Hi, I'm Lizzie Drury and I'm the Senior Nutritionist at Saracen Horse Feeds and I'm here today for the Saracen Horse and Hound Eventing Bursary. Right, one of the keys to weight taping is that it's preferably done by the same person um, on a regular basis. All the time the tape is in a similar position then you're going to start to get a more consistent reading. So what we're looking to do is to put the tape at the bottom of the wither so not on the top at the bottom so then we'll quietly drop the weight tape down good boy bring it right up under his elbow a common mistake that's often made is people bringing the weight tape and bringing the weight tape around as if you were doing up the girth yeah. the weight tape needs to be brought right up under the elbow here you don't want to be pulling it really really tight but we want to have it firm enough so that you can see the indent there yeah. and I can get a finger comfortably underneath. So we're reading from the weight tape here that he's 590 kilos, okay? From a body condition score perspective for the type of work that you're doing, um, he looks fine, he's really good. So at this stage, what we need to work on doing is maintaining that aspect, but now start to implement a change to help you enhance the performance. Because he's an ex-racehorse, we have to make changes very gradually. In order to do that, we're going to be doing what's called a two-part feeding system. So we're going to utilise a feed balancer. The feed balancer will remain, at the moment, the constant part of the ration. So we're going to be giving him, by doing that, a optimum level of vitamins, minerals and quality protein and the antioxidants. Then it's the exciting bit um, and this is when we can then start to play with the energy intake to allow you to reach that point where you can say yes we're there, I I've got what I'm looking for. The beauty of doing feed balancer and energy addition is that we can slowly manipulate that energy requirement up. So rather than coming in and saying we're going to put the energy straight in and he's going to have three kilos, that three kilos may then be too much that we then end up having him um, a little bit too excitable. So feed balancer and then we literally slowly increase the energy level until you reach that point where you're, yes, I've got that lift, elevation, presence and the stamina for what I'm doing. It may be that that's only half a scoop of energy. It may mean that actually we can increase that to a three, three and a half kilo. And that's what we will work with together through this bursary um, exercise to, to, to reach that optimum level.